Hi, we're Heavy Metal Beer Club. And today we are drinking Black Metal Imperial Stout. And that's from Jester King Brewing it's Company. It's from Jester King Brewing Company. <laughs> and they're out of Austin, Texas. You know, we got to go to Austin, Texas, because yeah. that is just a rocking place. Yeah, and someone, um, our, our good friends at Total Wine just told us about a great bourbon and said that it's such a cool place to go to. But also our friends at Arizona Beer House said that uh, this is a cool destination brewery, yeah. Jester King, to go check it out sometime and that they don't very often market their Imperial Stout, so that's pretty lucky we got a hold of one. And it was the last can left. It was a Saison's, I think, that Greg said that they had, yeah. correct? Yeah. Yeah, this was the last one they had. Last it's can left. 9.3% ABV kitties. It's funny because we are walking to look around oh. to see what they had, and that's my favorite wow. color with the stout. Oh my Ooh, God. Ooh, it's blue. And my eyes just went, mm. and I, Zoomed oh, in on man. this beer oh, because of the picture on hand. it and the black metal. And right when I said it, there was a nice lady standing oh. there that told us about the beer, and she knew that brewery. Yeah, she 100%. knew all about it. Wow. Look this at is that. It's black metal. That is motor And it was the oil. last can left, and I snatched that mother trucker. Oh, man. That is real. Now, that is black right there. That is very Ooh, dark. Take a look at look this, at, peepers. Yeah, look at the head on that. The head on that is even dark. Looks chocolatey. Don't know if it is. I haven't smelled it yet. To smell this. Yeah. you got to smell the cookie. That is so dark. You know what? Let me look at my smell glasses to see cookie. if I can even see through that. That is beautiful. It is. Metallica's it really, it black really is. album isn't even I, as dark I love as that. seeing a dark beer like this. Okay. Oh, you know what? I love on the... I love the, the can. I mean, that looks like uh, the guys from the Norwegian metal band, totally. uh, Immortal. What's the name of the guys? Abbott. Abbott. Yeah, yeah. Abbott. He, he did Abbott solo. Or Abbott? Well, it's spelled like Abbott, but when he says it, he says Abbott. Abbott. He's really Abbott. funny. He cracks me up, too. He's awesome. Let's, let's Check out that. the band. Oh, Can't go wrong yeah, with a little... Yeah, it smells. It smells um, chocolatey. A, a little black metal and a little black metal beer. <laughs> it smells malty. Wouldn't you say? Yeah, it does. Chocolatey, it malty. It smells more chocolatey than malty. Getting a little coffee notes in there? Yeah, a little coffee, a little chocolate. A yeah. lot of chocolate. Yeah, a little. I'm getting like a like, little burnt. Bur burnt brisket in. <laughs> I'm getting like a campfire, a little burnt campfire. Yeah, a little, a little s'mores and whatnot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It smells That's, good. Yeah, it smells really good. I can't good. wait to taste it. Cheers, let's taste that. It's monkey. Oh, wow. For, okay, first flavor I taste, smoke. Yeah, which I like. Yeah, he loves smoke. I like it too, but I mean, he adores it. This is yeah. definitely a smoky stout. I'm That's getting even kind of sweet. Yeah. Wow, it has a taste that lingers also. That's really mm -hmm. nice. This is a great surprise and yeah. a real treat to find. And the mouthfeel for being such a dark beer, the mouthfeel isn't isn't real heavy to me. It's a medium mouthfeel. It's a me medium mouthfeel. <laughs> Chester King, thank you. Thank you for making a black metal beer and for making one so good. Yeah, this that's is very incredible. Cool. We love you guys. I love you and I didn't even know who you were. Sounds well, you we wouldn't make this cool beer too if you weren't into metal. So we love yeah, you. Yeah, that's for Heavy sure. Somebody beer, there but... is a metal fan. Yeah. On the tasty meter, which is scale of one through five. On the scale of one through five, I would give it a. I'd give this monkey a. I'd give it a five. I love it. I I'll think go with awesome. a 4.5 on that. Mm. Yeah. It's opening up more. I'm, I am getting... In, I'm giving I, maybe it Maybe it was the power of suggestion. I'm getting kind of marshmallow. Yeah, marshmallow. As well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'd give it a and 5 I think I mentioned that even slightly sweet. It's hard to find a beer this flavorful, and it's really got a richness to it. It really does. So, sometimes a, a stout can have a great uh, label and name but it, it's a little thin. It's not super thick, but it's got all that flavor and body. Yeah. And it's it's perfect. Well, we gotta get more of this. Unfortunately, we bought the last one. <laughs> yeah. Well, that means we have to go road trip to Austin, Texas. I say we go. Let's go, like, on it soon. We are coming for you, Jester King.
Are you guys going to do any pumpkin beers? Let us know. Happy Metal Beer Club. We will be there. Yeah, do a Halloween pumpkin stout. And thank you so much for joining us here at Heavy, Heavy Metal, Metal Beer, Beer Club. Club. Cheers to you. Stay safe, drink responsibly, and, and stay, stay metal. metal. Yeah, I can't drink. Really. Yeah, I can't drink. Really. Yeah, I can't really. <laughs> A nine po- point ready? what percent? Three percent. Oh my god. Yeah. Is it called Black Metal Imperial Ale? Imperial Stout. Okay. okay not okay, Imperial. Okay.